to you. Hi folks, how are we? Just trying out the uh, latest bit of machinery to join the uh, Boil and Talk Sport. <coughs> Please forgive my jumpiness, I'm still not used to the noise of the damn thing, but uh, I've been eyeing one of these for a good while and uh, as the lovely lady was heading up to Argos to get a few other bits and pieces today, I just happened to spot one in the Argos catalogue and uh, it was extremely reasonably priced I have to say and I just said to her sure pick it up and we'll see uh, can we get it to um, work because uh, well she admitted to me herself that she broke three of them in her own job <laughs> and uh, I know for myself over where I in commas work myself in, in the local rehab centre uh, there is one over, or was one over there <laughs> that is was uh, notoriously temperamental and tricky, but uh, I used to be let loose on it every so often. But uh, please forgive my jumpiness if you see me jumping <laughs> uh, in the video or indeed in any of my videos because... The uh, spasms related to my uh, cerebral palsy have a habit of uh, making that happen when I hear sudden, sudden noises or sudden movements or that. The uh, biological, if, well, it's more, I suppose, neurological rather than biological uh, reaction is for principally the legs but to a certain extent the whole uh, body to engage in a motion which basically looks like jumping but uh, the um <clears throat> the um paper shredder will come in very handy because uh, in the world we live in today, as Darling just gets another sheet ready for destruction and has got a bit lodged in her tube, but it looks at like things as well. Uh, <laughs> in the world we live in today, uh, I would have a terrible fear and I would think, I'm not alone in this, but I would have a terrible fear of putting a... Uh, documentation in a bin or that that could um, contain names or addresses or god knows what sort of confidential details so even though we may be small scale enough at the minute uh, I like to think of us as a business both from a Boil and Talks board point of view and hopefully someday again from a farm point of view because I'm certainly not giving up on that altogether uh, and from a business point of view the last thing uh, I or you or anybody else wants is um, <clears throat> potentially confidential uh, documentation floating around uh, and getting potentially into the wrong hands so to that to that end and even simply for from the point of view of tidiness and keeping a bit of shape on the office uh the shredder will of course uh come in handy so i just said by way of keeping the YouTube channel taken over as well, uh, it was an opportunity to throw a quick video together. Hopefully it might um, come in handy or prove useful for somebody or other. Uh, I will um, 
sign off now, but I will say that hopefully by the weekend I may have another uh, recording of Drive Through Sports uh, weekly done. If it's not done by the weekend, it will definitely be done in the aftermath of the league game at the weekend. But in the meantime, folks, thanks for having a look in. Uh, Please don't forget to uh, like this video and share it. And please, please hit the subscribe button uh, to the Boil and Talk Sport YouTube channel. Because as I've said previously, and for anyone that is new to viewing our uh, <coughs> output, the more subscribers we have, the more uh, options it throws open um, with regard to um, the quality of content we can produce for you, the viewers. So thanks for having a look in, and I will talk to you all again in a few days, please, God.